Today it's difficult to imagine that nuclear bombs went off all the time in the 1960s, 70s and 80s. Imagine that over 2,000 nuclear explosions were conducted in over 60 different locations worldwide, affecting humans, animals and plants everywhere. We cannot simply, we cannot live with nuclear weapons any longer uh, at this stage. Either we are going to abolish nuclear weapons or we will be ready for self-destruction. And we have to make that simple choice. Either we put the emphasis on the sanctity of human life or we are going to glorify death and destruction. And that's really the choice we have right now. Because of that, we have to close the door on nuclear testing. And this is exactly what this treaty does, both for existing nuclear weapons and for future ones. And we have a superb verification system established in Vienna and with a global array of stations. And I think that should, all of us, inspire us to have greater confidence that not only no testing, but no nuclear weapons can also be verified. The international monetary system is composed of 337 facilities scattered around the globe. Each state, big or small, either hosting one, several or no IMS facility, is entitled to the same amount of data, to all the data. Its importance to the work of the CTBT relies on its mission, uh, which is to provide all state parties with equal, open, reliable and convenient access to all data from the international monitoring system and product from the international data center. It is clear that significant progress has been made in building up OSI capabilities and its operational readiness. On-site inspection is the final tool in the verification toolbox to clarify whether a nuclear weapon test explosion or any other nuclear explosion has been carried out in violation of the treaty. As a young person, the CTBT offers a hope for a future free of nuclear weapons and the entry into force of the treaty itself is a concrete step towards that uh, brighter future. The verification system that is a part of that treaty uh, is already being proven today and we're already seeing the benefits of monitoring nuclear testing throughout the world. It monitors the health of the planet, tsunamis, earthquakes, in addition to any country that might try to test. But the way it operates is it's true international public servants. It's professional and it's people from ev all over the world working together for our collective security. So it is important because it preserves peace. So this is the first step of preventing the use of nuclear weapons. And it's important to everybody, whether you're an African, a European, or a Latin American, or Asian. As long as you are a human being on this earth, it is important.